Chapter 1, An Injured Lion I am a very loving person, and I care about my family and friends more than anything in this world. I have the best group of friends that I could have asked for. We are always there for one another, and we always have a great time together. My family has been through a lot, but we always get through it together. My family will always be there for me during good and bad times. Chapter 4, Parent Lottery. In 1951, my grandparents immigrated from Germany to Ellis Island. I am proud and thankful for them coming to America to start a new life. I am also proud of my parents for all the hard work that they do to take care of me. My parents are very supportive, caring, and I am lucky to have them as my parents. Chapter 7, Never Made It to the NFL. At the age of nine years old, I started playing baseball. Baseball is my passion. When I am out on the field, I work hard, get stronger, and better each time. To be a professional baseball player would be a dream come true. Chapter 11, The Happiest Place on Earth. A lot of places make me happy, but the happiest place I have ever been was up in Manchester Beach. My family and I went on a camping trip. I think I remember this the most because we had so much fun as a family. I remember the ocean water was so blue, and one day I'll go back there. Chapter 21, J. There are a lot of people who influence me and I look up to, but the most influential person in my life is my mom. My mom has always been by my side since I was born. She has never let me down. My mom supports me, has taught me to be a kind person, and to work hard. There are times that we fight, but in the end, we love each other. I know my mom will always be there for me. I always want to just make her proud. Chapter 24, Recovering Jerk. In my lifetime, I have not made too many failures. As I get older, I may experience failures like the majority of adults have experienced at least once or twice in their lifetime. I believe that you cannot get through life without some type of failure. You can only learn something by mistakes. As for mistakes, I know that I have made a few, but the majority of them were senseless little mistakes. I think the biggest mistake that I have ever made and the one that I regret the most is not being there when my dog died. Some people may not understand and think that this is not a mistake, but to me it is. My dog Rocky was my best friend. We were buddies since the day I was born. We did everything together for 13 years and my mom could not keep us apart. My parents have taught me to do the best I can and to never give up. I have been lucky to have had positive coaches and teachers. I view adults as people who have had more life experiences than I have and I can learn from them and take their advice. I look at my future in a good way, not negative. I am responsible for my future. I want to graduate high school and attend college to get a good career. I am a positive person and am grateful for my family and friends. If I could have a legacy of wisdom for others, I will tell them to never give up and never give up hope for anything. Life is too short, only you can make the best of it. You are the one that chooses what to do. If it turns out bad, you only have yourself to blame, and if it turns out good, you will feel pride knowing that you did it. Life is not easy and you will stumble across situations that will not be easy and may never be easy, but you cannot give up. You have to always give it your best no matter what. Try to be as kind to others and never judge somebody without knowing their situation. That somebody one day might be your inspiration and motivation for your future.